this is what we're doing now. Welcome guys to the video. Actually, move this real quick. There we go. Welcome to the video. We have a lot, a lot, a lot to look at here. This is gonna be the patch notes, or I should be saying PTS from the new 8.7 patch notes, I believe it is. The, the recent one. So um, we're basically gonna be trying out some new items. Maybe Shogun Kasari, we could try out this game in a build. Maybe War Flag, maybe the new, well, really the same thing as Sentinel's Gift. We could try out Vampiric Shroud. I don't really have a build per se just yet. Physical protection, 55. Okay, so we're not gonna try that out just yet. We're going to try a Jade Emperor's Crown, um, War Flag, Shogun's Kasari build. We're gonna try that out. We're gonna see how that goes. In PTS, we're gonna see which items do I feel like is strong, which one do I feel like is kind of weak. That is what we're gonna do. So, well, what's this? Oh, we're getting a advertisement in the PTS, or not an ad? Uh, looks like a how-to on Cthulhu. I don't know what this is. Exactly. Anyways, I uh, let's get rid of that. We are on my Smurf of a Smurf of a Smurf. I forgot I even had this account made. It was the only PTS account I could get really into. I haven't been able to play PTS for basically a year, so I'll take whatever I can get here. Now. Um, so we're gonna go Jade first. So which tree is Jade? This one's Jade. Tree is 55. I believe. What do they give for the difference of this item? I, I forgot. Okay, it's trying to tell me how to play. Uh, we're probably gonna change some settings here. There's a couple though, it looks like. User interface, audio, we don't care about that. Spectator, key binding. Well, let's look at key binding first, actually. F1, doesn't look like anything's really crazy changed. Uh, targeting, 15, okay, that's cool. So, it's just telling me to start here. I didn't get any potions, I forgot about that. Yeah. There's like a lot of new farm on the map too, by the way. I'm gonna make sure to take these out eventually, but. For this video, I guess not. Don't really care who gets this buff per se. Does not really matter to me. But we'll just go and give it to Cupid, because that's kind of the norm. Over there is a new buff for really the ADCs that farm over. It's about the same thing as the minion wave in terms of XP. I think it's 52. Minion wave can be 31 for me to support, but I think 42 or 45 for the ADC by themselves. Right now they only look to have a support. But she looked to be able to clear the way or buff by herself. They did add some new farm over here. All right, let's see how tanky this is. Not that tanky, so very easy to manage. Cool, cool, cool. The more farm, cancel that. Get, get the wave, get the wave from. Wave is more important, pretty much most of the time. It gives you the most farm in the game in comparison. I'm not trying to stand in there. I can't even stand. He's already dead. Oh, he's dead. I could die here too. But, yeah. I shouldn't even try to like try body block any autos because he would have died anyways. So they get one of the farms and I just get out pretty much. I kind of have to go into this. Get a potion, get a potion. I'm trying, to, I'm trying to remember whether they gave to the new item. Here, let me give me a second. What did they do to Jade Emperors? They increased the health by five, by 50. All right, let's see how that works. The reason why you would even get this item to begin with is for high physical damaging like, teams. So we have Izanami, we have a horse, and we have Boxer. Horse is a pretty damaging uh, character to begin with. So I can understand buying it here. Makes okay. Makes okay sense to do that. Now. Okay. I'm not really looking for any fights though here. Punish him for that, but that's about it. So I got a wave here to fight against. So. For right now, I really just don't like our pressure. Trans, no pots. Now, they did decide to do something here. That. We can kill somebody here. Get him. His body blocked. She went over here. There. Come on. So we're taking their buff because it's about to be up right now. She has one owner, but it's up. You hit that, and I can go in zone. Great, we're out. All right. 
that cancel to come up right now. Get the wave though. That's more important. No, cancel that. Get the wave. Get the wave. Get the wave. Wave is more important. You can get, you can get that farm beforehand, but just in case she tries to push it out, I don't want it to be very confusing to get the wave. Or have the wave be closer to our tower when it doesn't have to be. But yeah, that. Luckily, he's following what I'm saying here, though. Luckily. He didn't have to. The way I look at the game is really the ADC, this is his lane, right? This is their lane. No, no, no. I gotta be careful here now. I'm in a bad spot. I could have died by a horse. Heal me, please. You can fight. There's a wave right here, bro. Guys, ultimate for free. We're out. Now you can leave. Now you can leave if you want to. There's a couple minions. No, there's not even a couple minions. Yeah. All right. Great. So Jade Emperor in a second. We can get that. So let me go to the back camps and go check those out. I'm pretty sure how it's gonna go is this is gonna be a little bit more farm for the support to get. I was watching Zap and he wasn't really getting this. Why did you fight again? So yeah, there's gonna be a buff for the supports to get because they are kind of like getting the junglers farm over here. And yeah, junglers weren't so happy about that. You, you're joking. <sighs> That's my ADC. That is my ADC. Um, so this is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna go take a wave and then I'm gonna go rotate to mid and then leave my ADC to do what he wants. And I'm just going to check out, see who else, everyone else is doing, and who's going to be the person to carry this game. Because I don't think it's going to be my ADC. So yeah, Jay's Emperors, um, sell the potion, get awards, and run to mid and find out who's going to be the carrier of the game. Looks like it's going to be Neja. Okay, so we're going to follow Neja around, not try to take his farm, and try and help him carry the game. We're taking this though, by the way, we're taking this farm. That's you. You got that. It's gonna be solo farm for you. That's gonna be solo farm. Um. So yeah, we're probably gonna gank that King Arthur in a second, actually, because uh, yeah, there shouldn't be a, a what's it called? Be careful. Okay. So there's an alley over there nearby. Letting him know that there's some people down there. <sighs> Unfortunately, he died. Yeah, that would have been a good gank for us to go do down there. There. Hopefully, he goes to follow me for this camp. Because this is kind of what he needs to be doing, anyways. He needs to get farm. Right. I'm gonna go over here and basically fight Bakasaur and make sure he doesn't. Okay, let's jump. I don't know if you can do anything else. That's fine. So that's the new skin. This jump is down. Oh, they're not in comms, forgot. Nice, good. Slain. Nice, keep it. You gotta kill. Yeah. Yeah. Things seem pretty good. I'll take one of his camps up here up top. Mm, no, he's fine. Oh no, no, now he's not. I'm away. Ah, shoot. You're dead now. Why am I so good at the game? Me, or right behind me, so. Poor 
unfortunate. I went for the horse because I figured he'd be a little bit easier there. To hit anyways. But yeah. I'm gonna check out red buff if I can. So I know it's up. I'm gonna be a little careful here about it, but come on, let's go this way. Oh, you're gonna go that way? Alright, fine. I got Maybe you can get yourself out. Because I have nothing else to help you. So, I'm going to leave. Go down to Cupid, get his camp, and that's it. Cool. Alright, so... That is that. We're going to try out the Genji's one. Try that out. Should be pretty good. I actually kind of like this build a little bit here. I have a war flag, which is pretty good in fights if we're in the lane. I have a Jade Emperor, so that means Baka doesn't hurt me if he wants to fight me. And then I'll have a Shogun, because that means Neja can get a little bit of attack speed from it. You're fine, bro. Get your camp. I don't have a blink, unfortunately. I'm willing to dive tower, though. You don't want to take that kill. But whatever. Uh, he died. Kind of unfortunate. But it is what it is, I guess. So, I'm gonna go back to mid. Oh, I did nothing. That little icon for all the camps, as much as it's kind of annoying, it's kind of growing on me, I will say that. Hey, what's up, boy? Why are you running away? You are cool. Easy, bro. Easy. It's a wave here that I'm gonna be taking, so. Alright. Really shouldn't be taking it, but honestly, I'm kinda fine with it. I wanna be getting this red buff too. It's kinda bad because Baka can stop me, but. I don't think he will. Freeze. Auto. That. Retreat. Retreat. We're gone. Get our job. We're gonna get out. We have camps to go get. You guys get that. I'm gonna go take out this camp here. Up top. I'm kind of just making sure they don't get the farm. So in a way, I'm hurting my team. But at the same time, though... I'm making it so they don't get a camp. So, is it really that bad to do? I don't think so. I'm gonna stay for a wave and then get out. As you can see, I'm not very much of uh, the helpful support. More of the selfish one. So, that. So they basically removed the CCR from it and gave them more attack speed. That's a lot of attack speed, by the way. So, I'm giving my allies a lot of attack speed while also reducing their physical protection. So I'm probably gonna actually get a mystical mail, not mystical mail, but Midgard mail. Where is it at? Uh, physical. This one, yeah, Midgard mail. Because this still would go with my aura effect of this Shogun's, of them not able to attack me as fast. So that's actually pretty good when I think about it as a combination. I don't think they really conflict with each other, so that's kind of like the main thing. Luckily, Cupid's not having too much of a problem with his Anami anymore, so yeah. No need to even worry about that guy. I kind of worry about my guy in mid. But I'd rather get to the King Arthur and just get him a tower already. Because uh, it's looking kind of bad for him. I'll be honest with you. So they put a ward on here. I'm ganking left lane. I don't really care about who shows up to help out. Tower for it's frozen. What are they here? Come on, get in here. Just hit the person. I'm taking for I don't know how long. Please hurry up. <laughs> this is what I don't like. This is this is what I don't like. People get so scared. You're not even taking the damage. I'm tanking it for I don't know how long. It's my job as support to give my life to the cause of getting the kill, right? So just go in already. Just go in. Just just go in. Trust. Just just go in. 
All right, so it's fine. We're gonna get Midgar mail, and it's kind of gonna be pretty good. Um, I don't really need CCR all too much in this game. No one really has it like a like a you know a CC effect. So I really get a crazy important like two stuns or like a, like real slow. Like Raw has a slow, Horse has a stun, but it's not enough. I don't see what's it called. Actually, maybe they do have enough. Actually, they might actually do it. Actually, because like if you look at it, New Loss has a stun too, so it might be worth doing it. Could be very much worth doing it. Uh, I don't know. And the reason I'm not doing the backs, like the health one, is because they don't give you as much. She's been slowed again. She took like no damage from me. Answer that. Uh, could have helped too. We're good. Answer that. Retreat. Please just run away. We're good. That actually worked out for us. They used freaking them out. Yeah, she doesn't have beats. Freeze there, you're dead here. I had to use my two there, didn't I? Hmm. That's unfortunate. Oh shoot. I made a couple mistakes there. That. Not very much. Nice. Oh, baby, it's a triple. <laughs> this is actually working out pretty well for us, isn't it? That was nice. That was really nice. We actually trusted each other there. That was sick. That was sick. I liked it. I liked it a lot, actually. Awesome. Let's go, baby. Let's go, dude. Easy peasy. Easy peasy. I'm not even gonna say, like, my team is, like, really stacked. It just... Winning this. He's trying out the Chiron's coin. Do more build. Ooh, I love that build up inside. I love that build. Okay, I'm gonna try that out when I get a chance. Alright, cool. There's like a lot of stuff to test out right now. They literally just broke the game with Smite. That we know. Alright, cool. Healing. What does this give me? Just healing? Alright, so it gives me. Come on, tell me. Buff in your mind. And, okay, allied god. Expires effect does not apply to other support buffs. Grants maximum health. Okay, okay. Plus additional 30 every 50 protections of the wearer. So basically, the more the more protections they have, the more healing you would basically get. Oh, they're fighting. Jeez. What are you even doing? Some people might die here now. Well. Huh? I whatever. Well, he gets health. I don't think I can, can do anything for this guy either. Now you're just kind of dead, actually. Yeah, you're dead. Sorry, but nah, I'm good. <laughs> I was down to give everyone my life so they could live, but I don't know. Radiance, the target of location allies. We're gonna try that out too. There's like a lot of stuff to try out. Um, we'll get a sentry too. So that was just kind of like a weird fight for me. I didn't like it. I didn't like it. So I kind of left. Was that the right thing to do? I think so. I think I could definitely could have helped him and I would have died for it pretty much and like I said I'm usually down to die but I'm not usually, I'm not really down to die for no reason and I felt like that was like no reason to die there so it's kind of why I didn't I chose not to not to die hmm. I'm gonna ward the uh, gold tree here I think it was like the better choice though because I could probably end up getting two levels ahead of this guy if I wanted to Thank you too, actually. I was like wondering why I wasn't able to do more like, damage on him. Like the guys up here. 
I think we just start gold, honestly. Keep it down for like 19 seconds, but we do have a Nage out with attack speed. And I have a buff that gives everyone attack speed. Naturally on me. Ah. Well, I would like to be the one tank in this place, but thank you. Oh, that was good. Oh, he still died. Hmm. I don't think it's really worth to do it. Just because everyone's coming back up right now. I thought he would have really, you know, I would thought he would have got that, but it's kind of weird he didn't get that. There's like a lot of new items you could try out here. Uh, plate boost this game planning, cost to build the game planning. Uh, what cost to lose friction building item frees up the goal with support supports. Okay, so why would I pick up this item? Allied layman's units have a gain, okay, 20% health. Whenever an ally guy dies. Gain 50 power per stack. All right, so we'll try this out today. We're trying out all the new items, essentially. So, yeah. As far as I can tell, you don't have to heal the heal um, your ally minions. That's what just made them busted. Really, only Raw was the only one that used this item. But now, okay, on my way. that new bracer, honestly. Yeah, I don't think I like that. Yeah, I don't think I like that. Alright. Let's push this out. They're dead now. I can take one more shot. Alright, pull them out. Yeah, we have minions coming up in a second. That's fine. Probably shouldn't went that far, but I just had to make sure they were a little scared to walk up a little bit. But yeah, that happened. Go for the Phoenix! Go for the Phoenix! What are you get? What are you doing? What is my ADC truck? What? You think you should be scared of one Izanami? Of one little Izanami? Look at that! She's dead in five seconds. Don't you dare to ever do that again. Oh my gosh, that was crazy, yeah. So the games are so much more like a, of a steamroll. You can snowball so easily now. Games are just done. All right, so that's another item we're trying out. Um, is there any more items on the list I can get? Well, there's the starters I didn't finish, and I can't get berserkers. Mystical mail, I guess I could get that too, or wing blade. Crowd control, I could get that as well, couldn't I? But I don't think there's a reason to. I think it's like just got a little bit of a nerf. It's not as, as good. Mystical mail, I don't really think there's a reason to get that either. I'm just getting Emperor's arm, honestly. I just don't know. Like, thanks to place in a radiant glow, target location, allies who move through this glow. Okay. From, so, do you. I need to know this then. Alright, so I'm gonna place this, right? So basically, I'm supposed to get like an effect when I walk through it. 
seven seconds all right come back seven seconds okay yeah so you have to be in the glow radius to get it pretty much and it re wears off pretty quickly all right so he's going over there they should be able to handle by themselves honestly we need to get fire already down yeah, they they can handle by themselves the sign's huge at this point Really, they're, they're not even that far behind when you think about it. They're like maybe two levels behind. Like, they're not really behind. I want to get this tower right here. Attack left lane. I think we can just get the tower for free. Let me see. He should get like a lot of attack speed from doing this. Let me see. Mm, that's a maybe. He's getting a good amount, but I don't know. Nah, not enough. Not enough. Not enough. Almost though, almost. Which is actually pretty good when you think about it. Yeah. Okay, cool. Let's finish this thing off then. Yeah, cool. Almost. I like the base here. We can't get the Phoenix, so I'm gonna back off here and set up for Fire Giant to begin this game. So yeah, Bracer is cool, but I think Frenzy is better still. That's what I learned from this so far. Like, Bracer is cool, but, like, you have to, like, kind of stay in the radius. So, I think if you're sieging, it makes sense to do that. But if you're sieging, you might as well get it in, um, get a Frenzy still, though. It just doesn't make sense. It just does not make sense. He's fine. He's not in any danger. Uh, we got a pretty good amount of wards here. We need to kill her, though. Fighting in mid is not the play, bro. Fighting in that is not the play. Like this, this is not a sieging tool. Let me read it again. Maybe I'm wrong. We're doing this without an ADC here the entire time. I think we just get mid Phoenix, honestly. I'm not tanking anymore. anymore. Be right back. What are you yeah. even doing? We just need the freaking ADC to actually get up here in time. He hasn't been here for like I don't know how long. Good in the game. I'm gonna make the best though. I'm gonna make the best. Yeah, get got to going. I'm already ready to go. Warriors flag. We'll upgrade it. Which one do they upgrade? They upgraded Spartan banner. Oh, the war banner. This one. This is all like a lot of stuff. And uh, enemy, okay, dying. For allies, this is a lot of sieging potential here. And a war banner. It's not giving you like the gold, but like, I don't think this is gonna be a problem. You could see this now, and like it would make sense. Like it's not giving you as much gold, but like, you don't, I don't feel like you need it. I don't feel like I've needed gold at any point. I'm level 20. 27 minutes and so is the other support like like we can easily get this get level 20 now i think they made the game more balanced in a way you could say even it's crazy 
Can I, can I even do this? I can. With this build, I can do this. And lose no health. That's crazy. That is crazy. I'm already about done with this thing. You could have waited and would have got an upgrade for it. Wait. Eh. I don't know if you did. I don't think you got it. Yeah. Uh. I'll have to find out what's going on here. Be careful left. We need to be attacking left lane. Yeah. Got it. My way. An enemy has I can't even help him out just yet. Hmm. I think this build's actually kind of busted. Honestly, when I think about it, it's actually a pretty solid build. Let me go look at my stats in general and see like what am I, am I like talking nonsense or like it's actually like legit, could be attainably attainable in a game and is actually like really good in a game. Because so far it looks pretty solid. Only test to know if it's really good is the winning every single game. I don't know for sure. Yeah, GG's though. GG. Let's go to the actual progress. What's details? Which one is it? Do it tell you how many protections you had or like stuff? Uh, yeah, thanks for the swap. Uh, so yeah, what what items felt pretty good? This one felt pretty good. This one felt really good. Uh, this one felt as good as usual but the problem was they're running away from me so it kind of doesn't defeat the purpose of it a little bit this one i didn't really get to test all too much but it feels like it could be pretty good 